Hi, I'm Mr. Greider. I'm the high school digital communication arts teacher. The communication arts major is broken up into four different concentrations. Those concentrations are cinema studies and videography, print and web design, photography, and writing and publication. Um, when uh, submitting your application for the communication arts uh, for high school in Cab Calloway, you will definitely need a portfolio. You really can't pass your assessment without your portfolio. The portfolio is uh, highlighted on the website with a rubric and a list of requirements. Once you are entering the room, you're going to be giving your portfolio to me or one of my student aides, and then you will be picking one of the three tracks to assess in that day. Those tracks are uh, photo manipulation, graphic design, or creative writing. From those three, you'll have an hour to complete your assessment uh, itself. And then once you're finished, you would hand that assessment piece in to me. And then um, with your portfolio, I grade all of those things for the assessment process for you to get into Cab Calloway School of the Arts. Right now in Digital 3, we're learning about filmmaking and animation. Digital Media 4 is a self-led, year-long project that the student has to um, direct themselves. My project this year is going to be a portfolio of posters that I'm creating for teachers, different academic teachers and faculty and staff around the school. So through this project, I'm going to be using InDesign and Illustrator and maybe a little bit of Photoshop. In Cinema 1, you learn the breakdown of everything. You learn the pre-production, you learn scripting, uh, shot lists, you learn all the little details, and then you learn the equipment, you learn how to go out and work with actors, how to schedule, and you just do a multiple little projects here and there throughout the whole Cinema 1. Cinema 2, however, once you got Cinema 1 down, you know how to do the whole system. So now you're kind of just creating your own projects. You're doing whatever films you want to do. As yearbook member last year and yearbook editor this year, I've really improved my leadership skills and I've gotten more familiar with Adobe's, Adobe Creative Suite products. AP Computer Science is a class that is taken online. You, it's a self-paced class. You work with Java Jar and you learn to code, you learn the breakdown of every little code, and you learn all terminology, and you get to code little, like almost like calculators, you can do sequences, you can create to where the computer can respond back to you. You also learn more in depth of AI and what the future has for us. Hi, I'm Ms. Protokovic and I teach creative writing at Cab Calloway. Uh, we actually offer three different types of classes at Cab Calloway for creative writing. Uh, the first course is Introduction to Creative Writing, where there are a number of smaller assignments that students do in order to show that they have the necessary background already in terms of being creative and transitioning that to writing. The second one focuses on taking those tools that they already have and refining them so that they can write very well done narrative pieces and give them also a taste into journalism. And the final course that we offer is advanced creative writing and that course focuses more on the editing process and publication. My favorite part of being a communication arts major is um, I'm really looking forward to learning all the different um, tools, how to use the cameras, um, how to use different software. I learned a lot of teamwork. I learned the importance of splitting up the job because you can't do it all. You need someone to edit, you need someone to screen, right? Um, I, learned, I learned a lot of equipment. I learned just things I didn't know existed. My favorite part of being a comm major is working with the school in order to maintain its appearance and its functionality. Things like the yearbook or live streaming shows or even maintaining the website. 